the network. Let's take it to more so, because a lot of people watching this, I, I, I'm sure there are some people that are watching this that are very interested in getting the same space that you are in. So let's say for the aspiring brand strategist or, you know, the person who's doing events in their community mm -hmm. that wants to be able to do events for the Red Bulls and the K-Camps and mm -hmm. those big brands, what advice would you give them to, to just start moving in that space? Um, You know, it's so weird to be honest, to be in the space that I am in and to have the connections and relationships that I have with people. Um, because sometimes I don't think about what I'm doing. Uh, I don't even realize the relationships I have. And to be honest, as I see here now and think about it, it's mind blowing to know that I have a contact with Red Bull. I have a contact at Google. Mm -hmm. I have a contact at Spinrilla, SoundCloud, YouTube. Like it's crazy to know that I have these relationships but everything started with me first attending events and making myself be known. Anytime I introduce myself, hello, I'm Portia Marie. I never say Portia. Anybody in the world name can be Portia. Anybody can be Portia, but I'm Portia Marie. And I make sure people, people remember that. And then if you forget my name, because, you know, everybody ain't the greatest with names. I ain't the greatest with names. But what I do is, and I feel like you forgot my name, I'll come and say, what's my name? What, what's my name? And you, Portia Marie. And then I leave and I come back. Nice to meet you. What's your name again? What's my name? Like, you gotta keep making people, you gotta make people remember you. That's, that's another thing. You gotta make people, don't be overbearing towards like, oh my gosh, get, the, get out of my face. But you have to make people remember you and you gotta stick to what it is. Don't feel like, oh, I don't wanna say my first and middle name because people don't think I'm bougie or I'm too much. No, that's your name. I ain't made Portia Maria. That's my name. Yeah. So it's just like if somebody feel indifferent about that, so what? But that's my name. It's so all respectable persistence. Yeah, yeah. it is. Yeah. And that's all it is. And so I just say get out there, be a part, be kind, be nice to people, speak, you know. Everybody, you know, I know some people are socially awkward, but just say, hey, you don't even have to say too much. You don't have to hold a whole conversation. Just be like, hey, how you doing? I'm Portia. Nice to meet you. What you do? Oh, bet. I do this. And then you just figure out ways to connect with each other. That's how a lot of my relationships build. I meet one person. I tell them what I do. They tell me what they do. I may be able to connect them to somebody. They may be able to connect me to somebody else. And then that's how the circle just keep, like, building. It just keeps getting bigger and bigger. So. so okay. So I'm glad you said that because what I was going to bring up was um, what me and just some of the other people we mutually know always talk about you is that it seems like a lot of the people you do business with, you're actually like friends with them on a, on, yeah. on a daily basis. Yeah. That's, uh, now, that's important. A lot of people, especially in the industry, people, people funny acting. You know what I'm saying? A lot of people are funny acting. Some people will just socialize with you just for business, but a lot of people will rather have that relationship with you to the point where they can trust you. Because a lot of people don't like to give out their contacts to YouTube or their contacts to Google or whoever because there's like, listen, my name is now on the line. Mm -hmm. And if you go mess up my relationship, then it falls back on me. So it's very important to um, build relationships with people. Um, you don't, every time you hit them up, it don't have to always be about business. You don't always have to... Um, Hit people up, you know, like, oh, um, who, what project are you working on next? We're like, what book are you reading? Or yeah. you want to go grab something to eat? Or, um, oh, that hair color look nice. Like, who did your color, girl? Like, whatever. Like, just um, try to figure out ways to build relationships outside of just business because it becomes very overwhelming um, because you got to understand people are still human. Mm -hmm. And... Um, People are still human. They get tired of just doing business all the time. Yeah. So you you guys sometimes treat relation like relationships, even though you just met them, like they're your friends or family versus business partner. Yeah, like you said, like you said, everyone isn't trying to talk about business. 24/7. No, especially especially I I feel like especially here in Atlanta where. It feels like 80% of the people here are doing business stuff or industry stuff. It's yes. like, dang, bro, I just got done with eight calls yes. a day. Yes. Let's go get lunch. And, yes. Yeah, I feel Let's like, go get ice cream. Yeah. <laughs> Leave me alone. Okay. It's the okay. Network.